Hi, I'm Mia from Corporate Cosmo. Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to add your opt-in subscriber form or web form on your Facebook fan page. Now, there is a application we must add to this page for this to become successful, and it's called Static FBML. And what's awesome about Static FBML is that it allows you to customize and increase the functionality of your page with some, you know, s some HTML or some FBML codes. So don't worry, you don't have to be a programmer to figure this stuff out. So what I'm gonna do is click on the application. So all I did is went in the search and type in static FBML, and I'm gonna click on Add to My Page. And of course, it's, it's asking me which page to add this application to. And of course, I'm going to click on the Corporate Cosmo page. I'm going to hit Close. So what I'm going to do is quickly go back to my page. This is what I need to make sure that um, this application is on my page. And so we can go in and add the codes. So what you want to do is click on Edit Page. Okay, so I'm going to scroll down until I see this application, which is right here, and I'm going to click on Edit. Okay, so this is the the page where you add in your codes. So of course, for my box title, I'm going to put Email Club to let people know this is where they can put in their email address to join the club. Now, the web form that I will be using comes from AWeber. So under the web form, you have the option to get the HTML to place on your website or any other website. So I'm going to click on publish to get those codes. Okay. Now I don't want the JavaScript, but I do want the raw HTML version. So all I'm doing is selecting all, and I'm just copying everything. I don't understand these codes. Who cares right now? All I'm going to do is copy it over. I'm going to go back to my Facebook fan page. I'm going to hit Control V. You know. Now instead of having just the the web form generator with just putting your email address and your name. I want to add a little bit of text to let people know, you know, why they should subscribe to my email club. And of course, I have this text ready to go that I have in WordPad. So I'm gonna hit copy, and I'll put it right on the top and hit paste. So I have my little intro, and of course, this is my. These are the codes for the web form generator. So I'm gonna scroll all the way down to the bottom. And I'm going to hit Save Changes. Okay. So I'm going to go back to Corporate Cosmo. Now you probably didn't see. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Well, we're not done yet. So what I'm going to do is click on Edit Page. I'm going to scroll back down so I can find my email club. club. And I'm gonna click on click on um, application settings. Now I want my email club to be on my tab, so I'm gonna click on add tab, and I don't need it in the box, so I'm gonna remove that. Click on OK. Click on view page. You've got this little arrow right here. You want to click on that. Click on Email Club. And voila, it is there. So for any more social media tips, please visit CorporateCosmo.com. Thanks.